Entering the Lunar Realm Blue Ghost 1's triumphant arrival On February 13, 2025, Blue Ghost 1 made history. The Firefly Aerospace Lander successfully entered lunar orbit. This was a major milestone for the mission. Blue Ghost 1 used its reaction control system thrusters to achieve this. The burn lasted for 4 minutes and 15 seconds. It carefully adjusted the spacecraft's trajectory. The initial orbit was elliptical. This means it was oval-shaped. The closest point to the moon was 150 kilometers. The farthest point was 5,673 kilometers. This orbit is temporary. Blue Ghost 1 will perform more maneuvers. These will circularize the orbit. A circular orbit is needed for a safe landing. This achievement marks a significant step. It's the 10th milestone out of 17. Firefly has a plan. They are going from launch to lunar operations. The team is excited. They are preparing for the next phase. Blue Ghost 1 is getting closer to its final destination. It will soon land on the moon's surface. Preparing for touchdown. Orbital maneuvers and scientific payloads. Blue Ghost 1 is not alone in its mission. It carries 10 NASA payloads. These are part of the Commercial Lunar Payload Services or CLPS program. This program uses commercial partners. They deliver science and technology to the moon. This helps NASA explore the moon. It also prepares for future human missions. The payloads have important tasks. They will operate until the end of the lunar day. They will even work for several hours after sunset. This is unique. It allows scientists to gather data in different lighting conditions. To land safely, Blue Ghost 1 must adjust its orbit. It will perform a series of maneuvers. These will gradually lower and circularize its orbit. This is crucial. It ensures a smooth descent to the surface. The landing site is near Mare Crisium. This area is a large, dark plain. It's located on the moon's near side. The landing is scheduled for March 2, 2025. It will happen at 3.45 a.m. Eastern Time. This will be a tense moment. The team at Firefly will monitor every step. The success of Blue Ghost 1 will be a major achievement. It will pave the way for future missions. Journey to the Moon From Earth Orbit to Lunar Insertion Blue Ghost One's journey began on January 15, 2025. It launched atop a Falcon 9 rocket. It shared the ride with another lander. That was iSpace's Resilience Lander. This was a historic launch. It marked the beginning of a new era. After launch, Blue Ghost 1 spent 25 days in Earth orbit. During this time it performed crucial checks. It made sure everything was working. Then it began its journey to the moon. The transit took four days. This is a long distance. It's a testament to the skill of the engineers. One highlight of the Earth orbit phase was a main engine burn. This was a critical test. It showed the engine worked perfectly. Blue Ghost 1 also captured stunning images. These showed the Earth eclipsing the sun. This is a rare and beautiful sight. A unique mission in a new era of lunar exploration. Another highlight was the Lunar GNSS Receiver Experiment, or LUGRA. This was a joint effort. NASA and the Italian Space Agency worked together. LUGRA achieved something amazing. It acquired GNSS signals, then it calculated a navigation fix. This was done at nearly 52 Earth radii. That's a new record. Blue Ghost 1's mission is unique. Other missions are launching around the same time. But Blue Ghost 1 has a different goal. It will land in a specific area, it will deploy NASA payloads, and it will operate for an extended period. This makes it a valuable asset. Blue Ghost 1 represents a new era of lunar exploration. It shows the power of collaboration, it highlights the potential of commercial partnerships. As Blue Ghost 1 prepares to touch down, the world is watching. This is a bold mission. It promises to reveal new secrets of the moon.